Pip's dazzling design solution to Suzanne and Andrew's nightmare plot clearly wowed them. So how's it done? Well, she's brought me to a cleverly laid out private garden in South London, designed by Simon Orchard, to show me. Oh, wow! Is this what you were expecting? No! <laughs> this is really quite contemporary and yeah. clean cut. It's quite Mediterranean, isn't it? It is, yeah, and the colours are, are really nice. It brings all the green out. Yeah, it doesn't feel very Mediterranean today. A huge main lawn area, shady nooks and outdoor rooms to chill out in. Is there a wood-burning stove up there? Pizza oven. Yeah, nice. Are all loosely defined by different kinds of soft screening. Just like Pip used for Suzanne and Andrew's design. Okay, let's have a little mooch. Now, this is where I immediately want to go to. It just feels completely different to, to the main lawn area. Yeah, steps, you're going under the trees. Yeah, it's, it's a framed little entrance. And it's just surrounded by plants. It feels quite exotic. The hardy palms and bamboo provide a natural division. Subtle seclusion without being completely blocked off. The gentle change of level and materials underfoot also help signal a sense of division. This change of material does a lot to, to kind of kid you into thinking that you've gone somewhere else. Yeah. A design trick that works brilliantly in small city gardens. So this is basically their little spa zone and quite a, an epic fire pit. It is. I can see myself sitting out here of an yeah. evening with a nice glass of wine. Reading a book. The greenery, that just softens it. It just makes it so much more inviting. And really quirky little features like the planting growing under the bench. Yeah. And then the kids, a little screen so they can play table tennis. The pattern screen is something that I really love to use because you can still see through, but because it's patterned, it feels quite sculptural. Yeah, it's decorative, isn't it? Yeah. In Pip's design for Suzanne and Andrew, she's used a similar pattern screen as a decorative sunshade. A must-have feature in a garden with Mediterranean style, offering protection from sun and rain. Kick back, it's still relaxing. You know, we've got to enjoy everything we can get. And this garden has a cool, organic alternative. So these are parasol trees. Oh, wow. Um, so they create a canopy over the seating area, which is nice because there's some dappled yeah. light that gets through. And um, rain. <laughs> Love it. 